Shangri-La. Arguably the hardest Black Ops 3 Zombies map, and for some reason, I want to get around 100 on it. Not only do I want to get around 100, I want to get the Zombies World Record for this map. So, right now we are trying for the World Record that is um, using uh, any gobble gum you want, you know, other than the banned ones, of course, like Power Vacuum and Round Rob, and there's a few other banned ones. But this first little clip is actually a little clutch piece um, that you saw. I just came out of the hole, uh, was not expecting all the zombies to be there waiting on me, and somehow I finagled my way around them and made my way out, especially off host. But although this is a round to 100 video, this is really going to be what to do if you're having a bad game. And this game, we weren't technically having a bad game, but whenever we started the strategy, which is actually a solo strategy, but we're trying to make it work for two people, um, I was... I really didn't like this little blind corner right here and I think the more times we run it the better we're gonna get at it and the more I'm gonna be able to predict when the zombies are coming around uh, it's just kinda hard whenever it's the first time you're running your strategy but like I said what do you do if you're having a bad game I've kinda lived with the thing of if you're having a bad game roll with it because even though you might be taking a lot of downs, uh, maybe your teammate's not having a bad game. Maybe it's just you, and and there's a lot of games like that. Like I'll ha I, like especially if it's my first game back in like a week or two, I'm gonna be having a bad game. I'm gonna be taking some downs. I'm not gonna be having fun. But the rounds will progress, especially if Tyler's not having a bad game. But this map, it, it, it's meant to be challenging. As you see right there, you just get smacked a lot. This is definitely a solo strategy, but like I said, the more times we run it and, and, and you know, we're not going to give up, it's going to work for us. You know, no matter what, it will work for us. Um, this attempt, first attempt, we actually got to like 50-something, and, I, I, you know, I going against my word here, it's like, I was like, okay, I'm done. Like, I was having a horrible game. My first down was on 50, and like, as you saw at the beginning of this round, like 51, I had four downs. So like, after my first three more, and that's not the end of it. There's there's more downs in this video. Um, but you just gotta, you, you gotta roll with it, you know? It's it, it's gotta be something natural, you know? It's zombies, it's, it's meant to be hard, you know? It's meant to press you, it's meant to down you a lot, but if you don't let that get at you, you know, you, you just keep your head up, you keep playing, you, you'll get through it. You'll learn that zombies is, it's going to get you down. It's, they're going to down you. The game's going to end. There is no winning zombies. It's just what round you can survive to. So, yeah, I, I didn't live by that advice in this video. We quit, you know. I could have got better you know I could have ran the strategy more we could have went to 80 90 whatever round but I was done you know it was late at night and that's another thing if you if you're going to start a zombies game start in the midday like start around like 10 30 not at night like 10 30 in the morning and and play all day because if you've had a full day like you went to class you went to work or whatever and you get home and you're like okay I'm gonna play a big zombies game and you play into the wee hours of the morning it's it's gonna frustrate you you know you've already had a big day you're starting to get tired you're starting to go down a lot and I think this is like at one or two o'clock in the morning and I was done I I didn't want to see it anymore but after this I think we played a little bit of World War II beta which if you haven't seen my video on should you buy World War II please check that out now and also if you haven't already joined the discord do that as well make sure you check the description and comment section for a link uh, big plans coming to that Hopefully I'll tell you guys about that later this week or possibly even next week. So I hope you guys enjoyed this. Peace.